Hey guys, it's Anna from Anna's Magical Moments and thank you for joining us today. And today we're going to do a little bit of an unboxing and a product review of Glitz Soap Company. So before I get into the unboxing, I actually got a uh, Wishes candle from one of my Bibbidi Bobbidi boxes boxes. I think this was like a few months ago and I didn't realize that there was something actually in it until I was re-watching, I mean not re-watching, but watching someone else's um, Bibbidi Bobbidi Box unboxing and I didn't know there was something in it. So I've been burning the candle and I actually, um, I, you know, I'm used to like f uh, fragrant jewels. I used to sell those, you know, back in the day uh, where like it was like an actual ring and so I was like, well is this like a Disney ring? But no, this was actually in my candle. It was, it's a little Snow White candle, I mean not candle, pin. My camera's having not a focus day, there we go. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty cute, I like it, a little Snow White pin. So we're going to do an unboxing and I, I, I am actually not new to this company. I actually you have the reason why I can do like a product review and an unboxing is that this is definitely not my first order. All the goodies inside. Oh, it smells so good. So basically, uh, Glit Soap Company is a um, they do vegan. Um, and uh, like hair hair products, um, was it hair? They do body soaps, um, moisturizers, uh, like just stuff for your body. And it's all vegan friendly and not tested on animals. And yeah, I actually got turned on to this by my friend who has a, um, she makes bags professionally so go check her out I'll put her in the uh, description I think it's Bequi I can't I really don't know how to pronounce her store name so I'll just post it she was like oh look at this product it's amazing and so I was like okay and so I got their soap their shampoo and soap um, let's see which one is this one so this is they do shampoo bars so this time I got cherry almond and they come in these tins but you can actually like order them without the tins I decided to um the dog is <laughs> my past few videos my dog's been kind of like going crazy when I'm shooting <laughs> so anyways <laughs> oh, animals anyways so <laughs> Um, like I was saying, um, you can either order them in these tins or you can order them without the tins because you can reuse the tins. Now, because I actually got the tin from before, I'm actually using it. This is actually what I've been keeping my engagement ring. I put like a little lining in it and that's where I put my engagement ring. I can't wear my engagement ring right now because apparently I found out I don't really wear jewelry so I didn't know that I have a silver, I'm like like sensitive to silver or probably like the doctor said probably the nickel that's in <laughs> the ring so until we reset it <laughs> I haven't been wearing my engagement ring uh, so I wanted a new one because um, I'm taking these to Disney or any of my trips really so that I can just go like that and then I can take my shampoo and conditioner. So she used to have the conditioner in bottles. And, you know, it's crazy. I actually bought the bottle shampoo uh, sometime in the fall or winter. And I still haven't run out of that stuff. Now, because of my hair texture, I don't, I don't wash my hair every single day. I mean, I, wa I rinse it. Um... But I actually don't shampoo my hair. I shampoo it every other day. And so I also, on my on the shampoo days, I will condition it. It's, it's a leave-in conditioner. And where the old one is. And then this, this is the new conditioner. Because she, because, you know, actually, like, I decided um, 
this year to try and use less plastics, um, which is kind of hard because um, it, it, it's amazing how much plastic you know a person uses in the household. So this is the conditioner. It looks identical. It smells identical. I'm gonna have to figure out how to differentiate these because they do look exactly alike. So I don't confuse them. This one's the conditioner and this one is the shampoo. So the conditioner is a little bit lighter, but when I'm taking a bath, I'm probably not gonna really figure that out. So put them in their right little boxes. Um, so yeah, so I, like when she said that she started offering the sh conditioner and the soap bar, I decided to switch over the soap bar instead of using the plastic bottle, even though it seemed to last forever. <laughs> like, um, I've gone through, uh, two shampoo bars and like one, um, of those bottles of conditioner. She still sells them online. I'm not sure if she's going to like phase those out, um, or if that's always going to be an option for the conditioner. Um, and... I also got um, soap. This time I went with lavender and chamomile. And her sh her soap, her body soaps smell so good. And they're so pretty. Oh, that smells so good. So it's like really fun colors. And this lasts a long time too. Um so yeah, I, I really like I I feel like you know when I use the soap, I, I, you know it's it's a bar, so not using plastic is like with the body washes, and also I feel like my skin's more moisturized, and um, I've my hair my hair's up, but um, my my curls are kind of happy today. Like when you have curly hair, you have days where your where your curls are not so happy. Let me look at this window. So my curls have been pretty good, like, and it's funny, um, if you have curly hair, you know that humidity, like, is not your best friend. And I have had days where the humidity kind of has made my hair a little crazy, but ever since using her shampoo, it's not nearly as bad as when I used to use more, like, the more of the commercial soaps. I mean, I've gone through all sorts of soap, com like, shampoo companies I've used, you know, like, uh, Herbal Essence, Pert Plus, Paul Mitchell, uh, some, uh, Suave, like, e like, the cheap stuff, the good stuff, you know, the ones made for curly hair specifically, the ones that say, you know, uh, help prevent frizzies, you know, and none of them have worked as well as her products. And, you know, and, like, when I first got them, I'm like, well, it's fall, it's going into winter, well, the real test is, is the Virginia summers, and it's been very humid this year, and so my hair has not been nearly as frizzy as it has been in the past, and I used to be able to have to change shampoos, because it felt like my hair would just get, like, like, really, really, like, dull and limp, like, if I u constantly use the same shampoo and conditioner, but I've used her stuff since fall, and I haven't, like, I haven't felt, like, the need to have changed. And the only thing I change is, like, the type. Um, like, so, like I used, um, well, this time I got the cherry almond, which smells spectacular, by the way. And, like, last time I forgot, uh, I think it was, like, the coconut one, and I forgot what the last one was that I got. Um, so, yeah, like, you know, I've changed you know, the soap, but I don't think her formula is really that different, except for, like, whatever she adds to create the scent, um, and I haven't had any problems, usually, like, when I order, um, she ships pretty much within a few days, it's not Amazon, but, like, I've, I think it's been, I think the longest, like, my order took to ship was, like, a week and a half, and I think it's because it was a Black Friday sale, so, like, she didn't really start shipping until the following week, you know, like, after the holiday weekend and stuff like that, and, but, like, I ordered this, like, I think on a Thursday, and I got it on a Tuesday. So, um, or maybe Wednesday, I can't remember anyways. But really fast shipping. She's based out of Pennsylvania, I believe. Um, and she has her own website, and I'll put it in. It's just glitzsoapco.com, I believe. 
I think that's the website. So I really highly recommend her, her stuff. Um, and yeah, I mean, I've been happy. I'm a happy customer. I don't really do product reviews, so, but I really like this product and that's why I'm doing it. So yeah, um, if you, uh, want more information, I'll put everything in the descriptions so that you can check her out. I'm not affiliated. I don't get anything kickback or anything. I just really like this product and yeah, like I said, I don't do product reviews normally on this channel, but I like her stuff and I like, and plus like, as much as I like Disney body soap, like, I, you know, these are a lot easier to store in, you know, my carry-on to, you know, go down to Disney. Because they're not liquid, and they're in their little tins, and so I get to take them with me. So I'll talk to you later, guys, and I will see you in a new video in the future. Have a magical week. Bye.